Petaluma River is about to get a big mm. makeover. Uh, the river marina being cleared of mud and debris. And as KPI X5's Don Ford shows us, it's a huge dredging project that's been years in the making. For years, Petaluma has been known by its nickname River Town. But by the state of affairs here over the last few years, it might as well have been called Mudville. Once a vibrant waterway, now silted in, full of mud. On low tide in the upper reaches near downtown, so shallow that even the geese walk. The Petaluma River hasn't had a full Army Corps of Engineers cleaning for nearly 20 years. We're just excited to get the work done. Our work begins, and uh, then, you know, it's great to have the funding and support of the community, and we want to get it done. This dredge looks like any other dredge, but listen, hear that? No, you don't, because... It is an electric dredge. Electric. Electric dredge, yes. We plug into the city, and uh, it's, it's great for the city because not only is it um, zero emission, it's quiet. Being so quiet allows it to operate 24-7. The contractor, Pacific Maritime, has 89 days to complete the job. It's estimated they will remove 191,000 cubic yards of mud and debris. On past projects, they found other stuff too. We found things like motorcycles, cars, um, shopping carts, you name it. I mean, stuff that you think wouldn't belong in the river, you know, it shows up. Today is final systems checks, safety reviews, and connecting the mud debris pipe. Congressman Jared Huffman helped secure the federal funding. After 20 years, we're finally dredging the Petaluma River back to life. The project should be completed in three weeks. And finally, after years, boats can once again travel in the river. Outdoor restaurants all along the banks are looking forward to new traffic, too. In Petaluma, Don Ford, KPIX 5.